She likes chocolate covered strawberries and wine. She likes notes that say I love you all the time. Roses at your feet, baby girl be mine. Baby girl be mine. Yeah. It's been a couple weeks, but I'm back. I'm going to explain everything probably on my way to work, but I have about two minutes until I can go to the gym. I'm gonna go do that, come back, take a shower, do everything, but I'm going back to work for the first time in two weeks. It's been a very interesting ride. I don't think I'm mentally prepared to go back to work, but here goes nothing. Okay guys, I'm back. It's like 7.30, I was at the gym for an hour. You can probably hear my music, but I was at the gym, freak. Oh my gosh, I was at the gym for like an hour and 15 minutes. The longest I've been, like ever, I think, consecutively, that, can I talk, consecutively doing stuff. I started Whitney Simmons Alive beginner because you know your girl hasn't been to the gym and like a long time and she's really out of shape and she's really insecure because um I had to go to the doctors and I weigh a lot more than I thought I did so I'm sorry I'm like so out of breath but yeah I'm gonna hop in the shower I have like 40 minutes uh until I have to leave the house so I'm just gonna play my tunes hop in the shower and um i guess really quickly because i kind of don't want to i kind of want to listen to music on my way to work basically i've been mia for the past two weeks because two prior sundays ago i was in the emergency room if i have the energy i'll pop up the freaking pictures and the boomerangs that uh gg and i were at but uh yeah i was having this really bad pain and uh, I found out like a whole bunch of stuff so then I had to fly home and go to the doctors but then they didn't have like they checked me to like make sure it wasn't like anything that needed to like get done immediately and so now I have to go back home next weekend because my appointment for like all my tests and stuff is on the 30th so yeah I also haven't gone to work in two weeks so this is my first time going back to work in two weeks so my life is kind of just a mess right now and you know these last two weeks have been like really depressing with no work and not being able to do anything because i was terrified of hurting myself even further than i already was because it's like the worst pain i've ever experienced in my life but um yeah and then like we've been having issues with like the guy next door because he plays his music until like six o'clock in the morning and you know your girl's just not having it so we're going back and forth with like the front office like i literally you guys don't understand i if you live in student apartments like don't do it if you're coming to unlv and you have to stay in like echo the degree the u don't do it it's way overpriced they don't care about us here like it's really bad they lie about their reviews online like don't just don't do it i'm warning you right now but uh yeah Gigi's parents came this weekend so i got to go eat dinner with them and stuff like that so she's not here but they leave today so i'm instead of rambling i'm gonna hurry up i can't believe like y'all look at my watch ignore my dirty clothes in the back but you can't even see i already hit my workout goal it says 76 minutes and i um beat my calories which if i'm gonna be working out like this i probably need to change my calories because i was doing it based off of not working out so my goal was uh, only 400 calories a day but uh yeah i'm already about to hit five so maybe we'll bring it back to five who knows but um yeah i'm gonna play my tunes on this girl over there i'm not gonna say her name or else she's gonna go off and uh yeah that was a quick uh, little spiel about where i've been for the past two weeks but these next two weeks are kind of gonna be exciting because i think next 
week I'm gonna film up until like Monday through Wednesday and then Thursday through Sunday because I'm gonna go home and I wish I would have vlogged when I went back home last time because it was like really fun but uh yeah those are the vibes do you really fuck with me? Tell the truth. Do you really love me? Do you really fuck with me? Came on my tombstone and they buried me. Out of the river they will carry me. Tryna please the nigga almost made me lose my mind. All right. I will see you guys when I'm off of work for the rest of uh, carpool karaoke.
your girl is literally in so much pain right now but i have five minutes until i need to get to the car if i want to be on time now i'm annoyed because i really want some juice and i just brush my teeth that's unfortunate for me um yeah i'm sorry i didn't end up vlogging yesterday kind of got caught up in the moment going to costco and target but um those are the vibes you know don't really have much else to do or say hopefully i'll vlog a little more maybe i'll do a little self care night oh happy um 420 to um, all my potheads, love and respect you. Hope you're being safe today. I don't have anything else to say about my body sore. That's it. <laughs> Richard. Yeah, this girl. I'm a horrible vlogger and I don't ever vlog. But we're about to have, ooh, they smell good. We're trying um, the Chick-fil-A replica chicken nuggets from Costco, courtesy of Miss Girl and her parents. Because we're trying to not eat the tacos until it's time for dinner. But we're trying to watch All American. Kulu, what's wrong with you? Why are you deleting the episodes? I'm not understanding. What doesn't make sense to me is like Law and Order, all the old episodes are still there from 20 years ago. Mm -hmm. So it's really, we're just gonna leave this right here. It's really not adding up to me. You want Chick fil A sauce? Yeah. Oh, geez, man. It needs to be in an air fryer, but it's busting. It's definitely busting. Oh, that's unfortunate. It's bussing though. Chick fil A won't be saying my money anymore. I don't feel like I'm up to turn the camera on. That's unfortunate. <laughs> Me too. Okay. No. This guy cat called me at the hotel today. Mm -hmm. And I wanted to cry. Because your girl suffers from anxiety. Oh, I gotta call my therapist back. I haven't gone to her in like three weeks. I was gonna say, I haven't heard you talk about your therapist. Yeah. She's gonna be yeah, well, let's catch her up on. I know. Because oh. I'm at home. What? I haven't talked to her since I went home. Like, I was supposed to have my appointment that Thursday, and that's when I got on the plane. I was actually at brunch when she called me. Bye. When it was time for my appointment. I will show the verdict came out today. I do feel. That's what we've heard. I mean, it should have been first degree, but... It's something than letting him go free and... Live his life. Mm -hmm. With his pension. Well, what's so crazy is we still have so many more cases that are going to be like this. Or very far from change. Very, very far. Mm -hmm. That was so good. Mm -hmm. Like, this is a snack. Wow, what a meal. <laughs> We're having tacos for dinner. Might have a shot of tequila. We'll see how it goes. Also, happy 420 to all you stoners. Me act like I no, my mom here act like I didn't post that on my close friends. Beautiful day over there. Look at all Dad, bring me, just bring one to the house for me. <laughs> well, all right, I'm gonna call Grandma and ask her where to get the French fries from. Okay, love you. Bye. TV shows. Hey, Grandma. Hey Maya, what's up? Hi. And she's gonna yell at me later and say, Why'd you show your friend me looking like this? But it's okay. <laughs> <Hey>. <laughs> I, 
is calling to ask you two questions. Okay. One, do you know where you get waffle fries from? The next. Because we found the like Chick fil A chicken at Costco and now we want the fries so we don't have to go to Chick fil A. Let me see what you, what you found, what the bag looked like. Oh, she's gonna pull it. We just showed it to my dad. That's my face. To save money. Uh -huh. and we love to eat out like we don't like to cook or anything like that so we're trying to find alternatives to the stuff that we do we could do chipotle here mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Yeah. so guys um, i look disgusting oh my god my tan is coming back uh i'm in the car the camera ended up dying yesterday and then afterwards we just talked and i ended up going best friend picked me up and I hung out with him last night so those were those were the vibes it's a uh, Wednesday and I need to go home and do homework cuz I guess I'm a student and whatever but uh, yeah those are those are the vibes today we're gonna go home maybe make some more chicken nuggets cuz I'm really hungry my stomach is growling at me but I need to turn the air on and you won't be able to hear me with the air so peace out all right guys it's uh like 8 30 I'm on my way to go to my eyebrow appointment I'm broke however if I don't go I'm gonna get kicked off from being her client because you have to go like twice a year and her wait list is like a lot of hundred people and I'm not I'm not here for that. So, we're gonna go get our eyebrows done. Yeah, I'm gonna listen to music and show you guys after I get my eyebrows done. Okay, guys, I got my eyebrows done. Um, you can't really see it, but they look really good. Shout out to Christy, love her. Never will let anybody else do my eyebrows ever again. And if she were to ever, like, move or leave, I think I would die. Um, so, yeah, I'm here at school. I haven't been on campus in a minute. But I'm about to go get my vaccine. I'm going to leave the camera in the car because, you know, uncomfy and whatever. But I can't believe I'm really about to go get my vaccine. I really hope I don't need anything. Um, let me FaceTime this girl real quick. Just to make sure because I don't think that I need anything except for like my ID. So Miss Girl, I don't need anything except for my ID, right? Uh and your do you have an insurance your insurance card on your phone? Yeah. Yes, that should be it. They're not gonna charge you, but they do need to see insurance. Okay. Alright, say less. I'm about to go get it. Yeah, no, don't make anything else. Okay, I'll be home in a few. All right, Miss Girl. Okay, bye. Bye. All right, let's go. Let's go do this. I'm so nervous. I hate needles. <laughs> Guys, I did it. I can't even see it. I did it. I got it. She's over there. She's cute. Um, they did have Pfizer, so you know, your girl's not a Pfizer princess, but it's okay. Um, let's see if my dad is gonna answer. If he's gonna be at work, I swear to God, I'm gonna kill myself. I don't know. I don't know if my dad is like. I wouldn't say like into that, but I know he's very like. Hey, Dad. Hey, Mara. I did a thing. You did a thing. Yes. What's a thing? <laughs> What's that? I got my vaccine. Oh, you got a shot, huh? Yeah. You gotta get another one. Yeah, I have to get out on the nineteenth. 
Thank you, Auntie. Go get hers. To so guys, um, it's a lot later. I don't even remember the last time I vlogged in the house, but uh, I fell asleep from like 11 to like 4 because of the shot, but I don't feel like bad or anything. My arm is just like a little sore, but yeah, that's it. But it's 9 o'clock, so I'm watching on order, and also I'm planning a trip with my two best friends. We finally all have agreed on a place to go, so August... It's happening. It's also some exciting stuff will happen with my mom. I'm very excited. So stuff might change in the next two months, like drastically. So I'm super, 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 super excited. But yeah, I'm gonna watch Law & Order and all that jazz and then still be planning the trip. But oh, I'm just so excited right now. I also got Chipotle. I just wanted to add that in there. Yeah, and then going back to work tomorrow, we're gonna ignore that. Also, I have my blanket up because it gets too bright in here and then I'll be having time for that. We just need to hurry up and move out of this apartment. But yeah, those are the vibes. I don't have any homework today. So yeah, we're just going to watch the Law and Order. And yeah, maybe get ready for bed afterwards because it's gonna be kind of late. So guys, um, I look a mess. I didn't vlog at all today, but I'm home. And uh, I went to work, had a long day, and I've been avoiding this. Ignore the Hello Fresh box, it's been here like all year. I just don't want to break it down. But I've been ignoring this dilemma that we have. So I'm gonna tackle it, I'm gonna be responsible, I guess. And um, I guess full died my life. It's a mess, to say the least. My arm is still so sore from the COVID shot. Like, it hurts so badly. But um, I've been made fun of for getting the COVID vaccine. I don't care, because your girl will be traveling. But, um, yeah. Those are the vibes, so I'm going to start on my laundry now. Right, she's clean. You can't really tell, but she's cleaned. I sweep the floors. Now I just gotta wait. Oh, I could put the trash out now. So yeah, those are the vibes. Now I get clean the living room, whatever you want to call this teeny tiny space. That was everything that was on the counters. Fix that. Now it's on to the disaster, or what we like to call my room. <laughs> Pick up your phone, I need your attention My girl so bad, we call her detention I am so glad we moved beyond friendship I am so glad your mama like me